Let's graph the linear equation y equals 5 6 x. And what we're going to use is slope intercept formula. You could use a table of values that would work as well, but this is actually a lot easier. So when we look at slope intercept formula, we have y equals mx plus b. b is the y intercept, but we don't have a b up here. We can just call this 0. So now we have our y intercept. We go over to the y axis here. We go to 0. And that's where the line for y equals 5, 6, x is going to cross our y axis. For the slope, we can call the slope 5, 6. And that's nice because it's rise over run. So we'll go up 5 and over to the right 6. So we go to that y-intercept. We go up 5 and over 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we have our points there. We could go up 5 and over 6 again, but we're going to be off our graph. So let's go in the opposite direction. Let's go down 5 and then over to the left 6. And there we have our third point. Let's put a line through this. Then we'll put arrows to show that this goes to infinity. And that's the graph for y equals 5, 6, x. Again, you could use a table of values, but slope intercept form here, that's really useful, especially when you have a fraction here in your equation. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.